Hey there, Oscar Carmona, owner of Healing Ground Certified Biodynamic Nursery located in beautiful Santa Barbara, California. Today I'd like to talk to you about how to vermicompost. Vermicomposting or worm composting is a really uh, effective way of turning your kitchen scraps into wonderful, important soil uh, food uh, for the benefit of growing healthy, nutritious, flavorful uh, vegetables and fruits in your garden. You can have a simple open bin using worms. And by the way, the, the variety of worm is called a red worm or a red wiggler. And those are worms that live in the organic matter layers of soil, which are on the very surface of the soil. They, leave it, they live in leaf piles, they live in uh, manure piles uh, from um, plant-fed uh, animals such as cows and uh, goats, for example, and chickens. Um, inside a, a bin like this, you'll find wonderful material that is being broken down and looks in like rich soil and uh, there's worms also uh, in uh, and amongst the material uh, to be used uh, uh, in the future and the worms are the agents that basically break down the organic matter and produce very rich uh, form of organic matter called worm castings. For a home environment and especially if you have concerns about rodents a contained composting system, worm composting system, may be preferable. Something like uh, this sort of a Tupperware container, uh, which I've uh, um, drilled uh, air holes around for aeration. Notice they're up high, they're not down low. I want to prevent leakage. If I do want to uh, um, pour off some compost tea, I'll tip the bin uh, in, in an area or into a bucket where I can guide the material and not have it seep out into onto a patio or into a car uh, port where it will stain and uh, look unsightly. But the worms are contained here and I simply add my materials. I have uh, strips of newspaper that I use both for a bedding for the worms and I've moistened that and also for a sort of a, a, a fly barrier to keep pesky uh, fruit flies and uh, hoverflies off my material. Um, and it allows for just ease of use. When you open the material, you don't have a bunch of flies going in your face, they're a nuisance. And this way, uh, you have a nice clean system, actually something you could have just outside your kitchen door at hand. It's gonna make your system that much more effective because you don't have to work as hard um, to get your material into a bin like this. Every three months is uh, basically enough time to produce a some quantity of compost. You can sift it out and separate the worms, put it onto a tarp, for example, and uh, sift out some of the compost. You can put that in potting soils, put it back into your garden, and it's, as I said, a wonderful return of uh, green waste in the form of raw nutrients back into your soil environment, which your plants will generously and eagerly uh, wick up providing you with the, the best nutrition and the best flavor possible for, your, for your, your wonderful meals that you create for family and friends. I'm Oscar Carmona, owner of Healing Ground Certified Biodynamic Nursery located in beautiful Santa Barbara, California. Feed the soil and let the soil feed you.